Some of the best music ever written and recorded is alive and thriving this month in the QCA. From the music of Frank Sinatra to Channel Cat Talks on Beiderbecke and Belson, Josh Duffy is here with all the scoop. Plus, the, the Bix Jazz Fest is this weekend, too. That's right. Not to mention that. We're going to talk more about that tomor oh, tomorrow. Oh, a lot of things. Josh. Yeah. Yeah, I'm <laughs> glad you're here because I know this is such a busy week for you. You're performing all over the place. Yeah, it started last Thursday and it goes through this Sunday with performances. So I've had 10 straight performances. Oh, that yeah. is so cool. All right, this dude. This dude right here. That looks like you. Oh, my gosh. The lights went out again. <laughs> there we okay, are. so we had this little, I'm going to call it a brownout. Is that what that was? And it just happened again. Isn't that weird? It's the ghost of Sinatra and Dick. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Maybe <laughs> that's around. it. Just when I showed this picture, this is Frank Sinatra from, I could, he looks like he was a child Yeah, there. that's from the Tommy Dorsey days from the early 1940s. That's yeah. when that's when he started. I mean, look at that that's handsome right. dude right there. I know, there. yeah. And, yeah. and one of the most beautiful voices ever. Oh, one of the best when crooners. Oh, yes, a one crooner. of the best by far. Yeah. Crooner. What's the definition of a crooner? A, a, a singer, a vocalist who's going to croon to the audience and sing and, mm. and make all the, the women melt out there and the husbands jealous. So, <laughs> <laughs> Who, Who's a current crooner? Oh, geez. Uh, there's, I mean, you have Michael Buble. Oh, He's Buble. A, yeah, so there's a great crooner right there. You're yeah. right. Okay, uh, Mr. Belson. That's right. Another one of the great drummers of all time right yeah. there, baby. Quad City's legend. Quad City legend, local. Um, so w w I had mentioned that Biter Back to Belson, these are two talks that you're doing. Correct, that, yes. yes. So, so tomorrow night, Wednesday night, uh, Travis Hosette will be singing with the Sterling Municipal Symphony Band. Mm -hmm. and it's a free outdoor concert with a concert band, so Sinatra music with that. Mm -hmm. And then we go into Thursday morning, and we'll be on the Channel Cat in downtown Moline at 9 a.m., and I'll be talking about Vic Spiderbeck and Louis Belson. I think, first of all, Josh, you're the perfect guy for this oh, because you. you know how you bring things to life. And I think there are a lot of folks who really don't know a lot about Louis Belson now. Right. Or even Frank Sinatra. Oh, exactly. And so the right? music we play is exactly like the recordings of Sinatra. And then when I talk about Bix and Louis, it's all the history in the Quad Cities mm -hmm. and about their lives, like the Cliffs mm -hmm. Notes versions of them. Mm -hmm. And then Thursday night, if people want to hear the music of Frank Sinatra, we'll be at Bass Street Landing at 7 p.m. for a free concert with a full big band. Wow. So you don't get to hear that music often with a full big band. You got to go to Las Vegas. Now you can go to downtown Moline for free. Good point. Yeah. You know, earlier we were talking about how cars tell our history. Right. So does music. It does. Yes. Right? Yes. It tells the story of who we are. Yeah, and jazz is the American music. It was yeah. born here in this country. Yeah. Show me that photo. We'll see oh, you yes. Them. This is a, a beautiful photo of the Gene Goldkett Orchestra with Bix Spiderbeck. Okay. And it's from 1927. And then starting on Friday, it'll be the Bix Jazz Festival at the Rhythm City Casino. And all the commercials have been on Channel 6 here, so people should be able to see it. I know. And come and attend it. If you thought Bix Spiderbeck was just a guy who started uh, a seven-mile run, <laughs> then you do not know. <laughs> you do not know Bix. What, what is the... What's the easiest way to describe who Bix Beiderbecke was as a young man in Davenport, Iowa? He was unique and was doing things that no other musician at the time was doing. And he wasn't classically trained or, or professionally trained. He just played by his ear, but he had a God-given talent that he was able to get through the piano and the horn. And mm -hmm. when other musicians like Louis Armstrong, Bing Crosby, Hoagie Carmichael heard him, they passed out at what he could do music-wise. Yes. And they were inspired. And um, we still hear him. He's still raved about. Oh, isn't yes. He? Worldwide. Bix. Yes, worldwide. And he had that, such an unusual name as well. Which, right. You know, I mean, that, that, that helps kind of define right, right. for people to remember who he is. Yeah. Okay, so no, l l let's go back over everything going on. Yes. First thing, there's something, is it tonight or uh, tomorrow night? Wednesday night, yeah, tomorrow night tomorrow, in yeah. Sterling, Illinois with the Sterling Municipal Band, Travis Hosette will be singing the music of Frank Sinatra. Okay. Free outdoor concert with a concert band. Okay. And then, yeah. So we, we do have sound from this, from uh, this is Fly Me to the Moon. Yes. The Travis Hosette Band. Let, let's hear a little of this. Fly me to the moon, let me play among the stars, let me see what spring is like on a Jupiter and Mars. In other words, hold my hand, in other words, baby kiss. 
one of the great songs of all time. What what year did that come out? Well, that was composed by Bart Howard, and I want to believe that was in the 40s is when that was released. Then. So that that's a Frank Sinatra song. That's one of those songs now you hear like in a movie or something. Oh or, yeah. Or a current TV series on Netflix. Right. And and probably current people are going, what is that? Fly Me to the Moon, Frank Sinatra, everybody. And I would say he's got that voice down. Yes, and Travis, this is Travis. his first time singing with a big band. He oh sang with like backing tracks and all that, but um, the vocalist we had had some family issues with his father, and so we called Travis. He's from Clinton, Iowa, wow. and does a great job singing the, the Sinatra music, and yeah, it's wonderful. Look at these two, Frankie and Peggy Lee. Oh, yes. From 1957, everybody, our love is here to stay. Let's do a few seconds. But, oh, my dear, our love is here to stay. Well, you know, and even if you weren't around in that era, uh, I think you can feel the magic of that. Oh, yes. Yeah. And the music of Sinatra, I've been finding more young people are coming out to our shows and listening yeah. to it because they hear that music. And we played an event in Minnesota, and we had so many young people there sitting in the audience singing the lyrics with oh. the band, which it's, is so wonderful isn't to see. is something? Yeah. yeah, talking about history, it, it comes to life, and in this case, you know, classically in, in every way. So the Sinatra events are, are uh, tomorrow. Yes. And Thursday. Yes, and okay. with the Channel Cat talk Thursday morning at 9 a.m., and then Sinatra that night at 7. And at that special show, I'll be playing Louis Belson's drum set. So Eric's forecast has been wonderful, where I'm bringing out Louis's drum kit to perform. There, is it this one? It's not that one. Not, that, that's not that I one. wish it was that, that one. That was earlier. <laughs> that was earlier. Yep, yes. it's one that Francine gave to me. Uh, yes. That was Louis's kit in Los Angeles. Yeah. And so this will be the fourth time I have brought it out. But I'm in downtown Moline, Louis's hometown. And that's where I want to have the, the community come out and see it. And Josh, it. you really do kind of, you, you channel the, the spirit of all of this, this whole era. And uh, we're so fortunate that you're here in the Quad Cities well, and, your, you. and your talent and who you are. It's a real special thing for us. So congrats on that and, and our thanks to you. Oh, for that. pleasure. My pleasure. Um, so uh, we have all these great events happening. Uh, there, there's the rundown so you can see uh, tomorrow and Thursday, uh, the Wednesday event there. And uh, and then, of course, the Channel Cat Talk, um, you know, hosted by none other than Mr. Josh Duffy right here. And there's all the info for that at, uh, in Moline. And then uh, this weekend, Bix Lives in the Quad Cities. We're gonna talk more about that tomorrow here on PSL, but uh, but Josh, thank you. Rest up. <laughs> I know you always give your best whenever you're performing. So. Oh, I love I love doing this. This is my passion for the last 20 years and I'm gonna continue doing it. Uh, we're, we're all the better for it, so thank you. Thank you so much.